So here is the BPQ server for Windows running uh, VARA, RDOP, AFSK, BPSK, RMS Gateway for WinLink, and uh, also sound modem for, for a few things like uh, APRS. And for the rigs, we have an IC718. And uh, that's for for 40 meters, 40 meters and 80 meters. I also have um, rig control on the BPQ controlling the radio. So at uh, zero hundred hours Zulu, it switches over to uh, 80 meters. Um, it also switches to 30 and and 20 for other stations. And next to it is the the bottom rig is a uh, a linko for the vhf port on bpq the next rig up is the d700 and that is for my uh, personal mailbox uh, next to it is the signal link and for the tnc's like i said i have sound modem on the server bottom one is in kiss mode here KPC3 and the top one is my personal mailbox for the dash one <clears throat> and down below what you can barely see is the power supply 30 amp power supply um, current draw on everything is about um, 7 amps when everything is transmitting at the same time <clears throat> next to it is a uh, pure sine wave converter which I don't use but it's there as a backup Got an 85 amp hour battery. I plan on adding another another one, but during a power outage um, and everything transmitting heavily, I can get about an hour and 16 minutes. So that 85 amp hour battery is uh, is running everything, um, and of course the laptop running everything is uh, running on its own battery. So. I can get about three to four hours use out of that. Uh, charging the battery is a uh, PowerGate PG40S. Rig blaster controlling or uh, powering everything uh, that you see here. So what I want to do is go ahead and cut the power to the power supply. Three, two, one. And now we are completely on battery power. little voltmeter and just for giggles we'll go ahead and initiate um, a mail transfer and let's try N9LYA that should use RDOP uh, or excuse me VAR if it's not busy and it looks like it is busy so it's not going to transmit at the, at the moment it'll wait for a busy Sounds like there's traffic going on here. And there is. So we'll let that time out. And let's try something a little more intensive. KB8 UVN. I'll try KB8 UVN with um, with packet, and I'm pretty sure he's not available. But you can see the voltage. And eventually that'll time out. And I'll go ahead and put the power back on. So eventually, that will go into charge mode, charge state, which it is. Once it get back, gets back up to 13, uh, 13 volts, it'll go into float mode. And like I said, I can get about, with heavy use, uh, about, um, about an hour and 16 minutes. So that's the 
24-7 packet station for Winlink and, uh, and everything else.